Hi, this is a quick demo of geometry scripting, a new experimental feature in Unreal Engine 5.0. The first thing to do to use geometry scripting is to go into your plugins browser, type geometry script, and check the box, then restart the editor. Okay, now I'm going to right click in the content browser, make a new blueprint class, type generated in the search box, and pick generated dynamic mesh actor. This is a special actor type that we can use to make procedural geometry in the editor. I'm going to call it box. I'm going to right click and go to edit. I'm going to switch to the event graph, right click, type rebuild in the search box, and pick this event on rebuild ger generated mesh. This is the event that runs to regenerate the mesh. Uh, I'm going to drag off the target mesh pin. I'm going to type append box. And that's going to automatically connect the exec pin. So I'm going to compile this and drag in an instance. And you see now we have a box. I can go back here and change the settings, change this to 200 recompile, and now the box is bigger. Here's a few other examples. Here's a box where I've exposed the settings on the box as parameters over on the side. If we look, I've just made some variables in the BP and wired them into that uh, uh, box operation. Here's no another example where I've got this little widget in the corner that I can drag to resize the box. So here what I've done is I've added a vector variable and I've exposed that with this show 3D widget checkbox. Uh, and then I've just used the vector XYZ and wired that into the box settings. So here's a few more complicated examples. Here's a stairs blueprint that uh, is sort of dynamically resizable. And I can change things like the depth, and it figures out the number of steps. So this is just based on a stairs primitive. Uh, and here's a cylinder where I've used the widget again to allow you to resize the cylinder and we've exposed the tessellation settings of the cylinder as well as a bevel on the top and bottom and the ability to do some subdivision to make a more complex shape. Uh, okay, thanks for watching.